Hello, everybody. Welcome. This is very exciting. This is, I don't know where to look. Not that one. This is our first ever game of Commander at Home, Shuffle Up and Play. <laughs> <laughs> game nights. Game nights. <laughs> in the, the command zone. In the command zone. This is very exciting. This is the first Game of Commander on Wubby Magic Monday channel. You guys have been asking for it, and uh, we've been wanting to do it. We finally are ready to do it. So hopefully you enjoy. I'm joined here with three employees <laughs> Fair. and friends who uh, oh, are in that order. In that, in, it's very important. In that that order. Order. All right, so let's get to know the lovely cast here. Starting with Hi, I'm Coast the Gardener. I'm an editor and I also stream on Twitch. And today I'm gonna be playing with Maronar. He gives all my rats fear and he generates more rats. So we're gonna have a lot of rodents on the field today. Hi, I'm Peanut, and I'm gonna be playing with Dr. Ian Malcolm, posing as Atla Palani. She's gonna make me a few eggs. Hopefully I'm gonna crack those eggs for a few dinosaurs. I can pay two and tap her to create a zero one green egg creature token with Defender. And whenever an egg I control dies, I reveal cards from the top of my library until I reveal a creature card. I can put that card onto the battlefield and the rest on the bottom of the library in any random order. So my goal is just to get all my fellas out and just swing fellas. big. All my, all, my fellas. all my fellas. Nothing but dinosaurs. This is a Jurassic Park themed deck complete with custom sleeves. Whoa. And it's very powerful. Dino Whoa. DNA. What we've seen. All right, young booty. Hi, as he just said, my <laughs> name is Post Malone. I'll be playing with my commander, custom made one of one by magic. You could put it up on the screen. That's Post the Enchanter. Uh, no, I'm playing uh, I'm playing the goodest boy deck. This is my boy, this is Paco. Uh, when he attacks, you guys exile things and then I go play fetch with him. Very cute. Very, very cute doggo deck. And I'm playing with a monkey. His name is Kibo, and he's a prince. I'm and playing he, with a monkey dick. I'm playing with a monkey dick, and he gives a, he gives all of my opponents bananas, which I have made little banana tokens because Wizards has not. And then uh, whenever they use my banana, I get monkey buffs. It'll all make sense, don't worry. But it's fun, and they get little banana treats. I was craving some potassium, baby. Draw. Now we draw. We draw. Oh shit! I was the only one sitting here shuffling. Yep. Well, I shuffled before the show because um, yep. I'm cheating. One, two, yep. three, four, I five, top deck six, only seven. the greatest. Yep. Carlos. Oh, should I start? It is. It, you get the honors of playing the first card on the show. Do you want to explain to the people at home what we do for our opening hand? Draw. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. So the person who starts draws after their turn. Um, their end step. Their, yeah, during their end step, they draw. But that's it. It only happens once. It's not for the rest of the game. I'm calling around. Carlos is going to swamp pass. Swamp pass. It's that dude. I got him swamp red. Ass. Red to filth. And then I'm gonna draw for my end step. Uh, I'm going to draw for my turn, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna start by playing a little restless ridge line. It's gonna enter tapped, and it has an ability where I can pay mana to turn him into um, a little dinosaur creature if I want. Island, <laughs> and then we're gonna pass. Ooh, you're playing island. There it is. No, that's huge you for me. You know what they call me? What do they call you? They call me an island man. Mm. <laughs> I think, right? Well, it can't Is be that a boy. what the cool kids say? Um, I'm gonna do something crazy right now. I'm gonna play Tigger. Whoa. I know, I'll play Taiga. And I'm gonna tap it, and I'm gonna play Carpet of Flowers. Oh, oh fuck. It's an enchantment, and during my main phase, I can uh, add X mana of one color to my pool, where X is the number of islands an opponent controls. So oh. thank you, Booty. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But I don't think I can do that now. That just got reprinted in Doctor Who, I believe. It did, it mm -hmm. did. Uh, and I'm gonna ass. Okay. We Untap really shamed blue drunk. decks away from this table to now where I leave, that's a... Uh, it's a bad look. Put a swamp, mm -hmm. and I'm going to tap two for everyone's favorite rat colony. Whoa! Rat Whoa. colony. He's ramping. Gets a plus one plus zero for each other rat you control. A deck can have any number of cards named rat colony. Surely. But I don't know if I need any more though. Surely you only have a couple of those. I there. think there's only a few in here. Okay. Make yeah. the noise. I think Carlos. he might even be one of the. Oh. There it is. <laughs> Every time he plays this deck, and every time the, the word rat is said at all, he <laughs> and I'm gonna pass. All right, untap, upkeep, draw. Hmm. I'm going to then play for my turn, just a little Cinder Glade, enters tapped, unless you control two or more basic lands. Sadly, I do not. So it's gonna enter tapped, and I'm gonna pass. I draw for turn. Uh, then we're gonna play ourselves uh, a cheeky mountain. Uh, and with that, uh, I will pass. All right. Untap, upkeep, drawer. I'm gonna 
target booty with carpet of flowers and add a don't sigh like that. I'm gonna add a green mana. Oh my god. I know. And then I'm gonna play a command tower. And I'm gonna use the floating green. I'm gonna tap command tower to add one of any color. I'm gonna tap Taiga and I'm gonna bring out Kibo. Keyboy. Oh, Turn to Kibo. And uh, he can't do it now, but like I said before, I can tap him. Each player creates a colorless artifact token named Banana with tap. Sacrifice to add green or red and gain two life. And whenever an artifact an opponent controls is put in the graveyard, put a plus one, plus one counter on creatures I control that are apes or monkeys. Mm. And then also when Kibo attacks, defending player sacks an artifact. I'll pass. Okay, I will untap upkeep drawer. Okay, I'm gonna put down a swamp. Mm. And then I'm going mm. to... A here. He's got three. Yes, he he's, he's getting out of control. That's cool. Guys, I'm gonna shake it up a little bit. Now I know you guys, outside of the game, you guys know that I added some new cards to this deck. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna tap two for one of those new cards, which is Rat Colony, I lied to you. <laughs> <laughs> so now, Damn. Rat Colony gets a plus one, plus zero for each other rat that I control. So what I'm going to do is since I don't want to confuse the table and add uh, a plus one, plus one counter uh, and just say it's plus one, plus zero, I have cheese dice. Mm. <laughs> mm -hmm. So mm. these will indicate the plus ones. God. Mm. So they're gonna get a plus one for each other. How can we swing on you now? <laughs> you just have a little farm. A little... Such a cheesy uh, play. And then <gasps> this rat oh. colony uh, does not have summoning sickness. So I will swing it You're gonna swing. at Peanut. I knew it was coming. You always swing. That's that. a good move. So he's a three-one. Do you declare any block? You got. Me. No, I sorry. Don't. I'll okay. breathe better. <laughs> How much three? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna take the three. I couldn't think of one with cheddar. <laughs> I thought I'd be able to. <laughs> I'm going to pass after that. Huge. That was oh, a good yeah? turn. Yeah. Mm. Surely I have an answer for it. Okay. Untap, upkeep, draw. For my turn, I'm just gonna play Reliquary Tower for no maximum hand size for the rest of the game, and I'll pass. Draw for turn. I'm gonna play a uh, storm carved coast, uh, and I'm gonna have to pass. Y'all brought heat to the first game. Untap up heat. Draw. Let's throw down an evolving wild. Whoa. So I will tap for one, two, and I will use the carpet flowers three to bring out thousand year elixir. It's an Whoa. artifact, uh, and I can activate abilities of creatures uh, as though they have. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, and then I can pay one and tap to untap a uh, target creature. We're gonna tap Kibo, uh -huh. which means everybody gets a banana. Bonan. Ba banana. Ba banana. 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 And I get a banana as well. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah, ah. And ooh. then I'm going to tap the banana, sack the banana, go up to life, and I'm gonna use the floating mana from that to tap Thousand Year Elixir. I'm going to untap Kibo. Let's do it again, boys. Let's do it again. There's one for you. There's one for you. There's one for you. And there's one for me. I'm going to go to my end step. As I pass, I'm gonna I'm gonna crack and sack my evolving wilds. Alright. I will untap upkeep. Joy. Joy. I grabbed a forest. I'm going to tap for three. And then I'm going to tap. Both of these bananas that you so graciously gave me. You're getting rid of the bananas now? I'm getting rid of the bananas now yes! to go up for life. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Add two red mana to my mana pool for a total of five. Oh, what and have I done? I'm going to cast. What have I done? Black Market. Oh, oh, no. Black Market is an enchantment. Whenever a creature dies, put a charge counter on Black Market. At the beginning of your pre combat main phase, add one black mana for each charge counter on Black Market. But wait a minute, you won't need my bananas anymore. <laughs> Banana dependent. I dependent. really could use those bananas still. I'll give so. you more. I'll um, give you more. Okay. And okay. now I'm going to swing both of these rat colonies at Webby. What the oh. fuck? Thanks for the bananas, what losers. What the fuck? I only like cheese. <laughs> <laughs> You're so rude. What you is know, that? I've never Six met total. a rat that liked banana before. Yeah. That is true. Bro, he, he did just swing at you, but I do have a question. Yeah. Which artifact on there do you like the most? <laughs> Slash enchantment. You're trying to destroy my shit? I'm just curious. What do I like the most? Banana. Uh, I... <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with you, man? I'm just asking. I'm just asking. Do you not want my bananas? I'm just saying. Uh, that is all I got, and I will pass. All right. Okay. We could we could work something out. 
untap, upkeep, draw. It's going to depend on this draw. <laughs> what? Because I have very limited options. Can't it depend on my ability to, to woo you? <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're going to get a little janky here, but it's the only way I can do this. I'm going to play Secluded Courtyard. When it enters the battlefield, I'm going to choose a creature type. I'm actually going to choose Human. Mm. Um, I can tap it for colorless or one mana of any color. I can spend this mana only to cast a creature spell of the chosen type or activate an ability of a creature of the chosen type. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to use that for my white mana. I'm going to tap one, two, three, four for red and green, respectively, to cast at the Palani. Whoa, Ian Malcolm. Also known Commander. as Ian Malcolm. I, I noticed you tapped out of your lands. You wouldn't have had to do that if you would have used my bananas. Right, I, I didn't use the bananas. Mm -hmm. okay, just, mm. they, they are this there. Is, this is free gruel. Yep. Mm -hmm. And two life. Yep. It would have been four. I love gruel. Mm -hmm. Just reminding you. I'm going to pass my turn. <laughs> I'm going to okay. draw for turn. Okay. I'm going to play a mountain. I'm going to tap one of my bananas. I gain two life. And I'm going to use a green mana and uh, uh, one mountain here to play Explore. You may play an additional land this turn Ooh. and then draw a card. Uh, so I'm going to play an additional mountain. Whoa. I'm going to draw a card. I believe I can uh, do one, two, three, four. Tap and sack my banana. Again. Alhamdulillah. Two life. Uh, to bring out Paco, the goodest boy. He's so nice. What does he's he do, so Booty? Good. Well, he uh, can partner. He has haste. And whenever Paco, the arcane retriever, attacks, exile the top card of each player's library and put a fetch counter on each of them. Mm -hmm. Put a plus one, plus one counter on Paco for each non-creature card exiled this way. Uh, so I can't take your creatures, but I can take your spells and your land to use. When you take a creature, it just stays in exile? It stays in exile, yep. <clears throat> Um, but I can't use them. I can only use uh, I can only use uh, ones uh, that are instant non-creatures. Non-creatures. Uh, so I'm gonna do that. Who's 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 feeling it? Who's feeling it? I'm gonna <laughs> well, don't, don't, don't point back. Don't point I'm moving to combat phase, <laughs> and I'm gonna swing Paco at the Cheeseman. Okay. And so before combat starts, yep. if everyone can exile the top card, we of all their have library, to do it. Yes, everybody does it. Everyone exiles the top card of their library. That's why it doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Uh, and then you have to let me know if it's a non-creature spell. Oh. This is gonna be a spoiler for you guys too. I don't want you guys to see this yet. <laughs> it is a non-creature. He just spell. pulled my wind is card. It, is a creature. This is a really good card for me. It looks like all of us. I give this to you. What, what is it? Read it out loud. Uh, this was uh, Karumonix, the Rat King. Toxic one, other rats you control of toxic one, you dirty whore. You're so, dude. You're a dirty is, whore. You're actually a whore for that. That's when he enters up. the battlefield, look at the top five cards of your library. You may reveal any number of rats cards from them and put the revealed card in your hand. Put the rest on the bottom of your library. Jesus. <laughs> no, but this actually was like the, the perfect card I needed. <laughs> you just ex You exiled my last March of the Ents. Oh, oh no. Oh, that means he can do it though. It's an enchantment. It's evolutionary leap. This is per This is just what oh, I need to get rid of eggs. I can pay a green and sacrifice a creature, and I reveal cards from the top of my library until I get a creature card, and I put that card into my hand and rest in the bottom of the library. Uh, so, nice. Carlos, that's five commander damage to you. Ooh, he's oh, a he's a five! Th oh, that's right, because he gets counter for every other. Oh my god! I thought attack. he was. I thought he was a one. <laughs> and with that, humble turn. I'll pass. Oh yeah, is that all? On tap. Hey. Apes together strong. I'm, I'm there. That commander hammer sucks. <laughs> Some bananas could be sick. Okay. I mean, if we're going to be apes together, I'm going to play land for turn. Uh, I'm down to be an ape together. So let's do that. Let's tap Kibo. Everybody gets a nanner. You get a nanner? You get a nanner? I get a nanner. Banana. Bonan. Banana. Let's, I'm going to tap two nanners. I'm going to gain four life. Two floating. Two, four. Five and six. We're gonna bring out Kogla and Yidaro. It's a creature. Oh, yes. Seven seven. When he enters the battlefield, choose one. It gains trample and haste till the end of the turn, or it fights a target creature you don't control. Paco! I'm going to fucking kill you. Oh my god. Wait, what's his PT? Seven seven. Oh my okay. god. He, he used to be in this deck. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on now. Hold on now. I might have a fight you. No, I'm getting rid of that. <laughs> no, he's so angry. <laughs> no, but you took my last March of the Ants, which is literally like you, my win card. You're crazy if you think he isn't going to do that on his next he's turn gonna, again. He's gonna hunt. I was, if it was like single target, I wouldn't, but it affects everyone. It affects, it affects everyone. everyone, I have to do it. Trigger, whenever a creature dies, I'm gonna put a charge counter on Black Market. Anyway, continue. That's bad. I'm gonna use the uh, one for, you only have one island up still, right? Yes. We'll do that to tap Thousand Year Elixir, or yep, and it's gonna untap Kibo. And you know what? 
We'll tap him again. More monkey. Everybody gets monkey banana. Monkey. Um, I have one mana left, but nothing to do with it. I'll Ooh, pass. So delicious. Untap. Upkeep oh, Roar. That, that was brutal. Pre-combat main phase. I'm adding one black mana to my mana pool for uh, black market. I'm gonna use one, that one floating, and then one more to cast, I think I'm gonna cast Rat Colony. Mm, that's oh, rare. Yeah. Brave. You don't you have that in your deck? So now these are gonna go to two. Plus two, plus zero. Mm. Then I will use the other two, tap two for Sting the Glinting Dagger. So Sting the Glinting Dagger is a legendary artifact equipment. Equipped creature gets plus one, plus one, and has haste. And at the beginning of each combat, untap equipped creature. Equipped creature has first strike as long as it's blocking or blocked by a goblin or orc, and equip cost is two. And then I'm going to swing just a single rat colony at booty. Mm. Just as a man. Mm. So it's gonna be four damage to you. Just as a. Mm. Mm. Uh, then mm. I will pee ass. Untap. Upkeep draw. Oh boy. Play down a forest for turn. And then I'm gonna tap two colorless. You have a lot of bananas. I, yeah, I really do. Amount. I mm -hmm. really scary do. Amount That's a lot of life, too. It is a lot of life. I think. And they're good for you. Before I do that, I'm gonna pay two so I can tap Ian Malcolm. So I can make a zero one egg with Defender. Mm. Ooh, what's that egg gonna do? Ooh, nothing. We don't want that egg. I think I'm gonna use all four uh -oh. of these bananas. That's not good. Oh. So you gain eight life. And I will gain eight life for that. If I'm there. And then one, two, three mana as well, additional for Black a total attack. of seven. <laughs> So I can play Rampaging Brontodon. Oh fuck. Oh, He's a 7-7 seven, seven with Trample, and whenever Rampaging Brontodon attacks, it gets plus one, plus one, until end of turn for each land I control. No haste. I think with that, I'll pass. I appreciate you using the bananas. Of course. Thank you. Untap, untap, untap. I draw for turn. Okay, let's go play an island for turn. Tap one banana. So I get two life. Oh, yes you do, I baby. need that banana now, I need yeah. that banana now. Yeah. Uh, and then I'm gonna tap one, two, three, four, uh, five. Banana was six. And then this will be seven to bring back Paco. We're gonna, we're gonna just, uh, we're just gonna be, uh, we're just gonna, we're just gonna, we're just gonna chill. We're just gonna You're chill. chill. We're just gonna, gonna hang chill. out. I'm just gonna chill. Really? I like that. I pass. Really? Mm. Okay. Untap. Damn it. All right, play land for turn. Let's get crazy, guys. Let's get really crazy. Mm. All right, I'll uh, tap two, and let's give it a uh, one, two, and skibbity. Actually, we'll use, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, yeah, we'll use the carpet of flowers. Um, you have, have two, two now. We have two we'll use two carpet of flowers. Uh, to play Seymour Muse. Oh. I untap all my permanents uh, yep. during each other player's untap phase. Uh, it's like unwinding clock, but for- But for everything. Yeah, everything. It's actually crazy. Okay, so let's start with Kibo's gonna tap and give everybody a nanner. Bonan. You, you guys know how it is. You guys know how it is. Banana. And then um, do like a banana. we'll tap, we'll tap the taiga to tap this to untap my boy. Tap him again. Actually. Let's 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 get crazy. What's the PTs over there, Peanut? Seven seven, uh, taps two three and zero one with the defender. You want me to attack? Cause you're gonna protect yes. with that goddamn no. egg. Oh. We're gonna swing Kogla. He's a twelve twelve right now. We're gonna swing that at Carlos. Uh huh. And we're gonna swing the eleven eleven Kibo at Booty. I will block with Rats. I will take the 11. Okay. So with that, uh, I'll block with Rat Colony, goes to my graveyard, mm -hmm. and I will get uh, a charge counter for Black Market, and then these will go down one, because a rat friend died. Okay, I'm going to pass. Okay. Untap. It's starting to heat up in here. It's starting to get a little I warm. untap all my permanents. Oh, right. Things um, to get too spicy. For in response to your untap, I'll tap these two and play 
Ancient Grudge. He's a cutie. Mm. Destroy target artifact. They don't have an artifact they think I should destroy. The only thing he has is this equipment that he has not equipped anything, but it untaps shit. Let's and do he it. needs to untap his. I'm gonna commander. show your. Uh... <laughs> he, he's gonna use it to untap his commander after every and combat. And all these go up because of that. Am I wrong? Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're. you're, you're um, right. All right. 100%. Now I'm going to draw. <laughs> Sorry, that was a <laughs> big untap step. I'm gonna add two black mana to my mana pool. Two. Three, four, five, six. Three bananas. For a total of six, and I'm going to cast Caged Sun. Oh no. As Caged Sun enters the battlefield, choose a color. I'm gonna choose black. Mm. Creatures you control of the chosen color get a plus one, plus one. Whenever a land's ability causes you to add one or more mana of the chosen color, add one additional mana of that color. So all my swamps are gonna tap two. for two. That's crazy. And mm -hmm. then all my black creatures, all my fellas, mm. I, hmm. are going to, what? <laughs> you know no, what I mean? Are gonna get a plus one, plus one counter. Mm -hmm. And these are different from the plus one, plus zeros. So ah, so different. the cheese is one zero. Correct. Ah. Um, now, we're playing magic. I'm That's going magic, to tap baby. this swamp for two. And I'm going to cast Cast Down, destroy target non-legendary creature. I'm going to destroy this. Yeah, that's fair. That's good. Mm, that's smart. Man, and that's fair as fuck. That's mm -hmm. going to put a charge counter on Black Market. Tap for another two. And I will cast Tragic Slip. Target creature gets a negative one, negative one until end of turn. But I'm going to activate it for its morbid ability. That creature gets a negative 13, negative 13 instead if a creature oh. died this turn, which it did. Oh. I'm going to put it on Rampage. Oh. Oh. oh, I was looking at mine like, oh, we're good. He hasn't even done nothing yet. And we're no, gonna keep it that way, nothing. buddy. Send him and back. And then that's gonna put another charge Fossilized. counter on Black Market. Uh, and then I'm gonna pass. All right, mm -hmm. politics. Mm -hmm. Fuck Black Market, we gotta do something about that too. I, yeah. I just need, I'm looking for one mana type. I need one mana color. What do you mean? I, I'm missing a mana color. Everything's untapped, upkeep, and then draw. Let's go! Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna play a plane. Whoa! Oh! Heart and of the then, cards. Just to throw you a bone, I'm gonna use a banana. Thank you. One colorless. Thank you. Throw you a banana. Thank you. And one white. I gain two life. And I'm gonna gain two life. Four wear and tear. Oh shit. I'll be casting both of these to destroy target artifact and destroy target enchantment. It resolves left to right. And I'm gonna destroy your cage sun and the black market. That's wow. so lame. Wait, oh, I'm so sorry. What, what, there was an artifact that you destroyed? Yeah. Then One artifact. Yeah. Go, on. go off, King. Think go about off. what you're doing. I, I can't have that on the field. Think about what you're doing. Go I off, can't King. have that on the field. Go off, King. Uh, so these lose their plus ones. Here's the thing, Peanut. You take care of Kibo, he won't swing on you. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah, buddy. <sighs> um, How much commander damage is that now? That's hard. Basically I mean, lethal. <laughs> Basically lethal. Lethal to booty. <laughs> I was gonna say, lethal to one person. Mm -hmm. And then, I think just to end my turn, I'm just gonna tap two to tap Atla again to make another egg. Now I have two of these guys sitting here. Your egg is the only thing stopping me from swinging on you. Yep. Because I know it's gonna... That's sort of the idea of Unless them. I get trample, but until then... I can protect help you me. out. The eggs protect. You take my shit. I can help you out. Okay, let's see. I'll just end my turn. Okay, let's get all these untapped. I don't know why I stacked them. Helps me figure out what I'm doing. I'm gonna draw for turn. First, let's do this now. I'm gonna tap for... Uh, Is that the Mr. Beast song? Two, <laughs> two islands. Good catch. Uh, two we'll islands. Uh, I'm gonna do uh, <laughs> two weird. mountains here as well for four mana. Uh, and I'm gonna cast a sorcery, Consuming Tide. Each player chooses a non-land permanent they control. Return all non-land permanents not chosen this way to their owner's hands. You're, you're. Then you draw a card for each opponent who has more cards in their hand than you. Yes. I have six. Yes, I'm okay with this. So we, we pick a non-land permanent. You, you're picking one to keep, not kick. And then every other non-land permanent goes to, goes to your hand. Okay, so then um, everyone's bananas, would they just get, would they go to the graveyard? I think they, they would they immediately, would... they wouldn't be able to exist in your hand, they would immediately just cease to exist. Cease to exist, okay. Mm -hmm. Do you have to as well? Unless you choose Kibo, uh, actually. Each player chooses non-land permanent? Yeah, I choose Kibo. I'm choosing this rat colony, he's gonna lose. Are you using your bananas before? Plus ones. Uh... I would not, he's just gonna keep Kibo and deal commander damage. Yes, I will tap both of them for four life. Okay. I have to keep Atla, I'll just get rid of the eggs. Oh wait, I'm gonna I'm gonna tap these to gain four life. 
I'm going to uh, use those two floating mana that I have to cast Timur Battle Rage, which target creature gains double strike until the end of turn. My Excuse Paco me? now has double strike, which I am going to swing uh, on Peanut. So okay. before uh, the attack triggers, everyone exiles the top card, and if it's a non-land, let me know. Yavimaya, Cradle of Growth, it's a land. So non-land. How do you always uh, I exile still the exile. best oh, cards I, I was exiling. Oh. He keeps exiling the best shit What's that you, I need. What? It's my worldly tutor. Oh. And that was your next draw. Yeah. That was my next draw. Uh, so I it's get, a rough game for you, man. So it was two non -land. <laughs> Don't remember you, though. <laughs> two non-land, so he gets a plus two, uh, which is double strike, so you take ten commander. Oh. And then I will... Booty... Do you like your commander? I love Paco. He's the goodest boy. Do you want him to stay on the field? He's the goodest boy. Um, and with he that, then I will uh, <laughs> pass. He said, mm. untap. I will, huh? Keep draw. Um, so let's tap a green to get Carpet of Flowers back. How many uh, islands do you have currently? Two. Two. So we're going to use the two from that, another green to play Thousand Year Elixir. Hey, it's that turn all over again. Well, let's tap for one, two, Three, let's bring out Court of Garenbrig. I'm the Monarch! At the beginning of my upkeep, distribute two plus one plus ones among two target creatures. Uh, and if you're the Monarch, double it. So that will happen next. I'm confused, Booty. I think I kill you here. I mean, you could. And I think, I, I think, unless you've got something, but I think I'm gonna do it. I see the opening, I'm gonna take it, and I'm gonna swing 19, 19. K.O. I'm gonna... First death. Yep, and I also just nuked my own carpet of flowers with that, too. <laughs> oh, it's oh, useless yeah. now. Well, you have no islands, right? No islands. No islands. It is officially nope. useless. And on my end step, I'm gonna draw for Monarch. Pass. All right, untap, upkeep, draw. Heart of the cards? Well, there's not a whole lot I can do. I'm going to tap for one, two, three, four, and I'm going to cast Chittering Witch. When Shuddering Witch enters the battlefield, create a number of 1-1 one, one Black Rat creature tokens equal to the number of opponents you have. So I'm going to create two Black Rat Why creature not three? tokens. Why aren't you creating three? <laughs> I'm going to use these custom tokens that I have, and I don't know which one's going to flip first. So oh. I'm just going to randomly pick a couple. First we got the German Rat. And then we've got some rats playing poker. Oh, poker rats. Uh, and then Rat Colony is going to get two plus one plus zeros for those rats entering. Um, and then I'm gonna pass. Okay. Untap, upkeep, draw. I'm gonna tap one white, and I'm gonna play Path to Exile <gasps> on Kibo. Yeah! You do get to search your library for a basic land card put on Battlefield Tapped. I had to do that, because I knew it was coming at one of us next turn, and I need to stop that. I was tapped out, otherwise I would have saved booty, but mm -hmm. I could not do that. Tapping two to tap Atla to make another egg. And then I think I'm gonna tap three more mana to play Ashnod's Altar. It's, oh, no. It's, over. it's no. over. It's not over, I only have one egg. It's over. What can I do with one egg? Okay, and using Ashnod's Altar ability, I'm gonna sacrifice a creature to add two colorless mana to my mana pool. And I'm gonna sacrifice the egg which is going to trigger Atla Polani, and so I'm gonna reveal cards on top of my library until I get a creature card. Okay, Needle Verge Pathway, nope. Evolving Wilds, nope. And the first one to come out is Galta! Oh, dude. Stampede Tyrant! Oh my God. These other cards that are not creature cards are gonna go to the bottom of my library in a random order. Bro, so ogre. Surely he doesn't have any dinosaurs in his hand though. So. Galta's ETB is gonna trigger <laughs> uh, when he enters a battlefield, put any number of creature cards from my hand onto the battlefield. And let's see, I actually only have one, so I'm gonna play Carnage Tyrant. Can't be countered, he's a 7-6 with Trample and Hexproof. Also, it's worth mentioning that a Galton Stampede Tyrant is a 12-12. And none of them have haste, so I'm gonna pass. Man, I'm tapping. Okay, draw. I'm gonna tap four to bring out, to bring out Curd Chieftain. Uh, he gets a plus one, plus one. Uh, as long as you control a forest, I do have a forest and I can uh, pay five and target creature gets plus two plus two and gains trample to the end of turn. I have two mana up, but not a whole lot I can do. I'll tap one to play Worldly Tutor, search my library for a creature card, reveal it and uh, put it on top. Yeah, I've had one of those. I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna pass. You do draw from Monarch. So I will draw the card I, I put on top and I have to reveal it, it's a creature. Yep. You can go though while I do okay. that if you want. I will untap, upkeep, drop. I'm going to tap for two. 
and I'm going to cast Rat Colony. Whoa. Uh, I'm going to tap two, and I think I'm going to cast Rat Colony. <laughs> <laughs> You that is, are, that is you, a little jank. I don't know if that's gonna. Hmm. He was yeah. smirking before he told that joke too. Yeah. He was he was proud of it. Yeah. He was real proud of it. I'm gonna put some counters on them, because I control one, two, three, four other rats. So these are all gonna go up to four. And then I'm going to. Done finding a creature, dude. Mm -hmm. Then I'm gonna pass. Off to the side now. I'm just shuffling. What creature did you pull? Molder slug. At the beginning of each player's upkeep, that player sacrifices an artifact. Oh, oh. relax, he's cute. Let's start by untapping all my lands. Hey, if it makes you feel any better, Booty, um, I think I'm about to lose to Pina. And maybe one. I think we're about to be trampled by that. Yeah, no one making yeah. me feel one better. Draw. Well, playing. Well, <laughs> so what you could have done is, <laughs> I think for my land for turn, I'm gonna play Moss Wart Bridge. It has Hideaway Four. It's gonna enter in tapped and or take off the top four cards of my library, I get to pick a card amongst them and exile it face down. Later, I can pay one green and tap this to play that exile card without paying its mana cost if creatures I control have total power 10 or greater. Mm. Well, do, to count it up, do they? just spoken riddles. I don't know what that was. It's a lot. It's a lot, and he doesn't need it. He doesn't need it. I'm gonna exile <laughs> this, been this really card this been face really down. Yeah, he stole my shit too, dude. And um, the rest go in the bottom of my library. Which is fine. I think after that, I'm just gonna tap two colorless for Adlapalani to tap her, and I'm gonna make an egg. Oh yeah? Can you guess what I'm gonna do with that egg, guys? You're gonna save it? Yep, you're gonna pass. Yeah, can should I start on tapping? No. Oh. I, think, I think I'm gonna sack it for two mana oh. to Ashnod's altar. Uh -huh. Giving me two floating colorless, oh, and I'm gonna look through top of my library until I get to a creature card, and we get 1-800, are you flapping? Yeah. It's the top of Primal Dawn. He's a 4-8. Flappin', double slappin', no nappin', scrappin', unflappable. Yeah. Is what we call that. Mm. Wow. He's not, no haste though. But I do have two other creatures that can swing. Oh. Well, he's not looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> oh. he's, not, he's not making eye contact. Uh, what, where? Is that ceiling new? I think I am gonna swing both of these at Wubby so I can get some good damage in. But the rats! I know, but you have artifact hate. So I'm gonna swing at you with uh, a 12, 12, and a 7, 6, both the trample. I'll take it all. Damn. I'll pass. I'll you gain Monarch. And I gain Monarch, so I get to draw a card on my instep. But yep. you lose my respect. <laughs> and that's, that's invaluable. Fair. That's, that's fair. really but invaluable. I draw. don't like you. I die unless you save me. I die unless I save me. <laughs> I'm gonna tap for two to bring out Goblin. Goblin, Goblin these nuts. Uh, my spells uh, that are red or green cost one less. It's five, but he's four with the Goblin, so tap four to bring out Kibo. Don't tell him, but he's just gonna die on the next turn. <laughs> so with that, I'm gonna pass. All right. Couple blockers. Untap, upkeep, drop. I'm going to play a swamp. Then I'm going to tap for one, two, three, four, five. And I'm going to finally cast my commander. Whoa! Maronar, all rats have fear. Uh, I may Ooh. tap and sacrifice a rat. <laughs> I may tap and sacrifice a rat to put X one one black rat creature tokens into play where X is the number of rats I control. All these rat colonies are gonna go up by one. So they're gonna be plus five, plus a zero. Oh shit, none of y'all have black either. Mm -mm. Nope. Or artifact creatures. Nope. I got monkeys. A very simple deck. Uh -huh. <laughs> and then I think I'm just gonna hold blockers and pass. Oh, Carlos, you are my only hope. I'm my only hope right yeah, now, I, dog. And you're thinking of you over me? <laughs> he that could ignore all of that and just hit me anyway and probably still kill me. This is the turn that separates the men from the boys. I'm but I'm gonna, gonna draw first. Satisfaction turn. To start off my turn, I have a couple options in front of me, but I think the safest thing to do is to tap two colorless to tap Atla mm -hmm. and make another egg. Yep. Then I'm gonna sack it. I'm gonna call it now. You're gonna get a raptor, the bad one. The bad raptor? The oh, bad raptor. The, just the card draw one? Yeah. You might be right. I have oh, two you know? floating <laughs> colorless, and we're gonna veal cards till I get Temple Altasar, top draw. Fuck! He's a three, four. If a source would deal damage to another dinosaur you control, oh. you prevent all but one. 
of that damage. After that, I'm going to tap one green to tap Mosswort Bridge uh -huh. so that I can play the oh, exile yeah. card oh. that I put face down earlier without good. paying its mana cost. But it wasn't good though. It's a Chroma's Will. Choose one. If you control a commander as you cast the spell, which I do, you may choose both. Mm -hmm. So creatures I control are gonna gain flying. Oh, it's over. Vigilance. It's over. Double strike until end of turn, as well as lifelink, indestructible, and protection from all colors <laughs> until end of turn. Now, Pina, let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Carlos can kill you. Right. I am not your threat. <laughs> I'm begging. <laughs> um, I can block for one turn. How? No, they all have vigilance. Fear. No, he has, he has fear. You can't block any you of them. You can't block anything. Uh, oh, you're right. He can, but, you, you cannot block him at all. So if he pops off... I'm going to gain a bunch of life, though. Still, though. At most, you'll gain I don't 25. think I can kill you. If you gain life with all the damage you're doing, I can't kill you anyway. Because I, yeah. I simply don't have enough swing power. That's what I'm saying. It's exactly enough to kill you. Yeah, that's what I... <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know. I thought you were still alive. I thought I was going to have to kill Wubby regardless. But I'm, I, you are the, you are the Yes! The I'm a small bean, bitch! I'm gonna get rid of the person that I know I can't even block. And I'm gonna swing Zatalpa, Galta, and Carnage Tyrant all at Carlos. Protection for everything, flying, it's gonna hit you. I don't think there's anything you can do to block it. And lifelink, double strike. Make a banana right now? Yeah. And I can survive with one. <gasps> I can survive with one if you make a banana I'm gonna, token right now. I'm gonna tap no. Kibo in response to your attack to clear. <laughs> I'm gonna make bananas everyone. <laughs> what are you Let's doing? Let's go! go! Oh, I just oh, threw my card. Jesus Christ. Whatever! I'm gonna tap. Instant speed, tap sec. Gain two life. <laughs> Gain two life. Yes, yes. So this hits you for, just to be clear, 46. Yep. Yeah. You had 45. Yeah, I just went up to 47. You gained 47. It's still gonna hit you for 46. Yep. Uh, he get one. He gets you one will, more turn. You will gain forty six. I do gain forty six life yeah. though. And you go down to one life. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. Um, We've given ourselves one more turn. A single turn. It's harder oh, than cards right here, dude. Yeah. Vigilance. They all do not tap. He's trying to figure out how to kill I you know, now. He's I looking know. for anything. It'd be really funny. But I totally can. I can still kill you. <laughs> if you kill me, are I'm you gonna, gonna counteract that beautiful <sighs> moment just now? This is so This is an even better moment. This is bullshit. This is the big player still doing the big thing. This is a huge moment though. This is the bad guy's win. Do it. Do, if you could do it, it's funny as fuck. On my second main phase, I'm gonna tap two to play Goblin Bombardment. <laughs> and I'm actually going to sack. I'm gonna sacrifice Carnage Tyrant and I'm gonna deal one damage to you. Oh. Taking you out of the Our game. Our friendship has permanently been damaged. Yes. <laughs> Real. Yeah. Well, with that, the rats go out with the whimper. What else you got, Peanut? Let's end this. Mono, electronic mono. With that, I do draw for Monarch. And in response to your end step, I'm gonna tap Sack Monkey, go up to life. I'm going to use that mana uh, to tap my Thousand Year Elixir to untap Kibo. I'm gonna tap Kibo, and I'm gonna give us both bananas. That's it. All right, untap. This is it. Uh, heart of the cards. I have Blasphemous Act in this deck. I have uh, a few board wipes. Mm -hmm. um, you have to draw it. I have to draw it. Here we go. I play forest. Mm. We're gonna tap. Get some bananas. Okay. Right. Yeah. This mm -hmm. is good. Mm -hmm. yeah, this is good. good. Okay. I like this. Ooh. We're gonna use two bananas. I get four life. And we're gonna tap two to play Beast Whisper. Whenever I play a creature, I uh, draw a card. Okay. One, one, two, three, to play Molder Slug. I cast a creature, I draw a card. It's a mountain. <laughs> <laughs> it's a mountain. <laughs> At the beginning of each player's upkeep, that uh, player sacrifices a artifact, uh, oh. an artifact. I'm gonna um, pass. So as I move to my upkeep, I have to sacrifice an artifact. I'm gonna sacrifice a banana. I'll draw for my turn. I will play Temple of the False God. For my land, it adds two mana, activate only if you control five more lands. Uh, I'm gonna tap that for Atla to make an egg. If you sack the egg, you're so mean. I'm gonna sack the egg. Why? Just kill for me! For two colorless, I can't kill you with this. In response to you tapping her, I'm gonna tap, tap to untap Kibo. Okay, that would make an egg. Yep. First off, that would happen first. I sack the egg for two colorless. I'm gonna reveal cards until I get a creature. Life finds a way, mountain, forest, 
And we get Ripjaw Raptor. Whenever he's dealt damage, mm -hmm. I get to draw a card. I have two colorless. I'm gonna use that. Uh, two green for four. And then I need four more, which is gonna nearly tap me out. One, two, three, four for a total of eight mana to cast Polyraptor. Mm. He's a five, five, and whenever he's dealt damage, I create a token that's a copy of Polyraptor as well. And now, oh, fuck, this is so good. I am gonna do the deed, and I think swing at you with Galta, a 12-12, and Zatalpa, a 4-8 with double strike. One is flying. Can't block that. So I'm so guessing I'll, you can't block it. I'll take the eight, and then I'll block uh, bitch with uh, four five, four six. Okay. Four six. Okay, so that'll die? Yep. Six goes through. As I move to my second main phase, I am going to sacrifice Ripjaw Raptor to Goblin Bombardment, and I'm gonna deal one damage to Polyraptor to make oh. a copy of Polyraptor. Okay. Uh, in response, I'm gonna tap Kibo. Bye -bye. Whoa. And that'll be my turn. Okay, I'm gonna untap. Um, uh, this is bad. What's Polyraptor's PT? Five, five. At the beginning of my upkeep, I'm gonna distribute two plus one plus one counters. I'm gonna take two off of him and put four to him. Let's bring, uh, let's bring out the whole ocean. We're gonna tap two, mm. uh, two, mm. and one mm. to play Kogla. He does uh, fight a target creature, which I'm gonna have him do now. Is anything gonna die to a seven seven? Temple Altasar, as well as Polyraptor, let's but get, it would make another Polyraptor. Let's get rid of Temple, Temple Altasar. Okay. And uh, you draw a card for... I do, thank you. Um, I'll tap for one, two, and three. I get two life to play Entish Restoration. Mm. I'm gonna sack a land. I'll sack this uh, forest here. I'm gonna search my library for two basic lands and put them on the battlefield taps. If I control a creature with power four or greater, which I do, uh, I can do that with three basic lands tapped. So Ooh. I'm gonna grab three lands right now and put them in tapped. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And with that, I'm gonna pass to Peanut. I'm gonna untap all my lands again. Everything's untapped and then I will draw. I'm going to play Temple Garden and I am gonna shock it in so that way it enters untapped. I lose two life. And I will go ahead and tap two for oh Temple no. of False God to Atla to go ahead and make an egg. And I'm gonna go ahead and sack it to Goblin Bombardment to deal one damage to Polyraptor to make another copy of Polyraptor. Does Polyraptor have haste? No, he does not. This one will have something like this. Okay. And then I'm gonna look for a dinosaur from the top of my deck. I keep revealing cards until I do. Cultivate, Lightning Greaves, Primal Command, Mana Crypt, oh no. And Galta and Maverin. No haste, he's 12-12. Uh, whenever I attack, I can choose one. He has trample. Like this that. is King Kong. The, the, the monkey versus the dinosaur. <laughs> it, it's, it's the happened. dinosaur ape versus the dinosaur vampire. <laughs> I mean, yeah, yeah, the details are muddy. Let's just go balls out, you know what I mean? I'm gonna swing uh, Galta, yep. Zatalpa, yep. and these two Polyraptors at you. Okay. So that's five, five, flying double strike, four, eight, oh, and 12, 12. I think. All right, this might kill you. Okay, so we're gonna do, we're gonna block. You have to take the flying. I'll take the flying, so that's eight. Eight, eight, eight One, two, off the bat. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have 11 coming at me. These two Polyraptors do not have Trample. Okay, so let's block the Trample Galta with a seven. Okay, so five will carry over. Okay. Uh, we'll block uh, both of those with uh, these two. Okay, did both of them die? They both. Okay, there's no Trample, but they were dealt damage, so these will die, but they make copies of themselves. Yep. And so they're still on the field, untapped, and this is another Polyraptor that has summoning sickness still. I got one more in me, guys. Mm -hmm. One more heart of the cards draw right here. That's this it. could be it. That's it. Last this is the card. Exact commander damage. Uh, at the end of my turn, I'm going to tap five mana. Three, four, five. For Pantlaza, Sun Favored. Uh, whenever he or another dinosaur enters the battlefield, I may discover X, where X is that creature's toughness. So for Pantlaza, I'm going to discover four. I'm looking for the first non land card with mana value four or less. That would have been Game Ender. Quartzwood Crasher and uh, get lost. So I'm gonna play get lost without paying its mana cost. I'm gonna destroy target creature, enchantment, or planeswalker. It's which creates two map tokens, and I'm gonna destroy Kibo. In response, I'm gonna tap, tap, untap, and retap, And then Kibo will die. 
You suck! You, hey, you get two map tokens? <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna be my turn, yeah. Okay. Yes. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna play this. Um, it comes in tapped. I'm gonna show uh, three visits that I opened in the that one uh, video, but I'm not gonna play it. <laughs> and I'm gonna pass. Untap, upkeep, draw. I think this goes without saying. I think I swing at you with everything. Just I think do it. You, yep. die. you also could have killed me with gobble that. bombardment on your end step. Yeah, and for those at home, I just am able to swing with everything, and Yay! there's nothing more oh. we can do. He is dead. Boo. 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 is the winner. Boo. Boo. Wins. Boo. Boo. Yeah, boo. Boo. <laughs> good job, that was good. You did it, Peanut. Thank you so much for making me lose on my own show. I hope everybody had a good time watching, uh, and uh, I, I hope you guys had as much fun as we did. Carlos. Hello, I'm Carlos the Gardener. You can check me out on twitch.tv slash Carlos the Gardener. Hi, I'm Peanut, the winner. You can also check me oh, out on twitch.tv uh, slash Carlos the Gardener. <laughs> 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 booty. Uh, my name is Booty Swagger. Twitch.tv slash Booty Swagger. Go to slurlore.com. That's slurlore.com. That's, that's not a joke. That's real. That's real. And uh, thank you guys for watching. I'm Wubby. We'll do more of these if you guys watch them. Okay, bye, everybody. See you next Monday. Bye. bye.